so in order to move forward to cross this quantum bridge I need to just uh, explain something that is inherently classical but has uh, very deep consequences in the quantum world and this is these fields and by fields no we are not talking about these nice fields here we are talking about physical fields so this is Monterey and this is your cosmic kingdom To introduce you the concept of a field, I'm going to go back to Newton. We all know to Newton's story. He was sitting there, an apple fell on his head, and then he had this Eureka moment, blah, 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 blah. But what is important is that he described the, the force between two bodies like that. Just because they, they have mass, they will attract following this formula. But until the 19th century, it was painted like that. Just an interaction between two bodies. And if you have multiple bodies, you will have multiple interactions, and that's it. So let me remind you that the electrostatic force, which is there, has the same, same, same shape as a gravitational force. And that brings me to the early days of the, of the 19th century, where this young scientist, Faraday, was just starting to understand what was the... Um, the electric interaction between bodies and as I say it has the same shape as Newton's but this guy with little education little formal education he had like a strong instinct and he uh, apart from just discovering many 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 like effects that are there like Faraday, Faraday cage the Faraday's law etc that can we can talk about that on a different episode he introduced the concept of a field so instead of thinking of the, as the gravitation or the electrosta electrostatic interaction as a force between two bodies, what he proposed using his intuition is like, in the moment you have a mass, that mass is creating a field around it. Or if you have a charge, that, that charge is creating an electromagnetic field around it. If you place another mass or, or another charge in the field, they will interact with it. Then the quantum revolution came and for instance, for the electromagnetic field, this field is carried by photons, by light. For the gravitational field, it's supposed to be gravitons, but we haven't still found them. Will we find them? I don't know, it's in the future, but I'm sure if we find them, I will make an episode about it. So I think that is all for today. Thank you guys for tuning in. Here, are my, here is my, my social network. If you like the channel, please subscribe. If, if you like the, the episode, please click like. Thank you very much and see you soon, guys. Bye-bye.